Hello guys, this is the Gacha Marmies, the visual novel. I'm going to start it. Cuckoo, you can't force her to enter if he doesn't want to. But... Ha ha ha, it's alright Cuckoo. I can't really force her. Besides, our game is pretty good. Where is your game anyway? It will be in a few weeks. It's the finals, you know. Our opponents are a pretty good team from another school. They won several tournaments before. I'm sure Senpai will win. He is the best player I know. Yeah, she is right. You're the best basketball player I know. She'll be able to win this. Oh, come on, guys. I'm not that good. I just love basketball. Well, I'm really looking forward to your game. Why is that? If I do run that game, I may be able to get someone responsible. I may even be able to get into the professional team. It's my dream to play for national team, you know. Senpai can do it. He is the best. You can do it. Senpai will be cheering for you. Gee, thanks, guys. I'll be sure to play my best. It's not him. It's good to see a friend of mine so excited to enter my head about something. Guri is a pretty good player. I believe he can achieve his dreams of getting into the professional league. You. We walked up quite sweat. Despite not playing, he still had the lot of stuff to help Kugari with. Cuckoo kept the was motivated because as she would shout in roaring occasionally without her scary face, which is a plus. <coughs> I'm currently sitting on the bench, taking a rest to practice is already over. And only a few people linger, including myself, Cuckoo, Ali, and Kugari. I still have some time. What should I do? Okay, talk to the girls. Decide to hear and talk to the girls. They seem be to be taking amongst themselves. Well, Ali is daily talking. Cuckoo is shooting a shell. Hey, girls, what's up? Oh, Keki, nothing. We're, all We're mostly t talking about random stuff. Senpai is so cool. See, random stuff. Hey, Senpai is in random stuff. Sure, Cuckoo, if you say so. Actually, Cuckoo, I'm rather curious. Why do you like Kuri so much? Isn't it obvious? He is so cool and handsome. And a very good player. Cuckoo, calm down. You're laying your obsessive his and then sees speak for you. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. It's hard to control myself when I'm near him. It's almost like she has multiple personalities. She just swapped from fangirl to shy mode. I don't know how to how severe her Obsessive te and te sees her. But if she can get us ashamed of it, it must be a yeah, problem sometimes. <coughs> hey, Cuckoo, it's alright. We ha all have our own little quirks. It's not something to be ashamed of. Even more, if it's not your fault, oh, you got it. But I pulled one of my hands on her shoulder and squeezed in. And in a answering manner. Besides, you constantly cheering everyone on help to uh, stay mot motivated. You can see that you can't motivate the nurse because you can't focus. 100% on oh, the goal in front of you. And that's a dream Keiki thinks that me is a lot hot to me. I smell like a hot cuckoo. I remove uh, my hand from my, her shoulder. She is looking down for, for some reason. I, I will be going now. Sorry, Keiki, I think I will have to answer your question another day. 
I want to remain sane for a little while longer. Watch Cuckoo's retreating form. She stops momentarily and her face almost turns in the direction Cougar is. Before she take, shakes her head, she keeps walking forward. Hopefully, I manage to cheer her up, even if just a little bit. That you're a very charismatic hickey. Uh, what? You mean? What do you mean, Ali? Never, not everybody has the pa a chance to deal with Cuckoo when Senpai is near. She really did lose, lose most of her, her friends because of the problem. Take most of her friends because of the problem. Take behavior. Actually, I think we. We are the only friends she has left. What? So the reason she said that. It really does mean a lot to her. If she did, and because now you are a friend before. <coughs> she definitely does now. I didn't know that. I mean, I didn't interact with them occasionally. But I never knew how lonely Cuckoo was. Well, she... You're right. I think she will. She just needs some hair to be. I'll talk with her later. Alright, tell her that she can count on me, on me too. Okay? Okay, Katie. I'm sure she will appreciate it. After giving my goodbyes to Aoi, Kugari, and Cuckoo, I came back to the classroom to get my stuff. It was around 4.30 p.m. The staff is already pressuring a lingering students to leave. I guess, as I go, I guess I go, we will we'll go. Well, everything gets packed. I better get going. I walk towards the door. Huh? What the heck just happened? For a moment, I could swear something was really wrong. I can't feel my heart breathing. racing. This feeling was faint here somehow, but I can't exactly place where I felt it before. I thought most of is tense, almost like the world itself got scared about whatever just happened now. Did I hold to the end? I'm not mentioning it. So am I? I look at my left hand. The catch's word is here, shift shift into a simple, nondescript ring. I feel myself up, calm down slightly. Never was I'm not the halfway less far from it. Logic can leave their shoe. Hold me now. I think in this world that should be scared me. After one face, but still. <coughs> Before I knew it, I was rushing out of the class, sword in her hand with my speed. It took me all less than three seconds to arrive at the source of the screen. What I saw was, was <coughs> finding right that the source of the screen. Now me. My senpai is laying there on the floor. Fall down. It took the moon shattered, eyes closed, and an invisible plane. I looked around and made sure there was no danger before my senpai noticed. I quietly hide the sword back in, in, in a terrain form. She was moaning in pain. Senpai, are you right? I hushed down. I want to take her closer. Look at her. Cool that's you at the same time. But anyway, are you hurt? I offer my hand to her. She looks for a moment. Probably a little dazed. And then takes it. I'll help her up. <clears throat> what happened, Senpai? Are you hurt? Wait, 
That's exactly what I felt earlier. Senpai, you felt it too? She sounds wheezy when talking about Nooniverse, like Cuckoo, who is the nurse who got corrupted. <coughs> <coughs> now, he was one of the ones who was sucked in by a corrupted Looney and had her own insecurities twisted. He was afraid to fire us. <coughs> she doesn't seem to remember much, except that I. Eh? And Ellie were involved. Senpai, can you remember things clearly? She sounded scared. I can't blame her. Well, she is brave and over Ellie. This to me. Southerner will scares her. She he prefers not to be well. <coughs> Still, I have to tell her the truth. Senpai, you noticed your that your body seems much stronger now. Did you? I did. Well, things from that world can affect us, but only if they come over here. Only a handful of things are powerful enough to cross dimensions, and all those who can are kept and checked by the clear. She bent over and started to pick up the shared documents. I also learned down and then started to help her. She sent me a grateful smile. Ah, uh, another cool. I just bought the guy to he clip this part of my life. Everything, Senpai, that's it. Hey, you're the perfect role model for students. I'm the president. It's my job to be a role model. But thanks anyways. I appreciate it. Uh, thanks for the help. I can see she is still nervous. And then is trying to make small talk to see her nervous. She looks at me in the eyes. Her sm small smile is still oh, in here. Although I can't detect the small traveling in the hand. Okay. Okay, bye.